Hey there, njroot22.com with our top five deals for Valentine's Week 2019. Hey there, guys. Notice how I said uh, Valentine's Week 2019. That leads us to our opening rant. Not a big fan of forced holidays. Uh, anyone that knows me knows that I don't like being forced to uh, be nice to people. I don't want to be forced to be affectionate to people. Um, I think the holidays are, are a scam. And um, I, I don't know why so many people fall for it, just uh, to stay in line with the, uh, with the rest of the people, the lemmings out there. But anyway, we're going to get rid of these hearts. Boom. We got a nice brick wall here. That's the way to do it. Um, we're going to talk about our uh, top five deals this week. Uh, I'm going to start off with, uh, you know, like we, like we always say, Kings. I'm not a big fan, but they do have deals that are affordable and often cheaper than other stores. So this week I found one item and it was the Hoboken Farms uh, pasta sauce or tomato sauce, red sauce, gravy, whatever you want to call it. It's... Uh, buy one, get one free. They normally charge nine bucks a jar. It's four fifty a jar when you buy two. Um, they're very good sauces. They're gluten free. They're they're just really really good. I, I personally think they need salt, but that's good. At least they're not too salty. I add salt to mine. They're very good sauces, and I highly recommend them. And this week we found a few items at uh, Shoprite that are sort of worth it. They uh, starting on the thirteenth of February through the nineteenth, they have Jimmy Dean bacon. They're only twelve ounce. Uh, Packages and they do uh, they do not contain sea salt, which is a big no-no. The Hormel low sodium one and the um, Oscar Mayer uncured one are the two that I like to buy at the supermarket. Uh, but push comes to shove, two forty-nine for twelve ounces is, is really good. Um, they also have uh, these Myers lemons. They're fantastic for my um, Smirnoff drinks. And they're a buck ninety-nine a pound. And that comes out to about four or five uh, of these lemons. They're like hybrids with oranges, but you squeeze a little bit in, it makes your drink wonderful. Um, and also, they have a wholesome pantry chicken. They're both organic and non-organic, uh, 25% off. Those are those are ShopRite's best uh, chicken options, in my opinion. Um, so this week, you can get them all uh, cheaper. Getting back to Valentine's Day, I mean, I really think it's ridiculous. You should probably overwhelm your significant other with one of these 70-inch tall um, teddy bears. They're a uh, hundred bucks. Just, it's overwhelming. You can't not like it. It's a hundred bucks and you get a hundred dollar gift card. I mean, a crazy card. A hundred dollar gift card. So it's free. If you like buying things at Ocean State Job Lot, it's free. But this, it's a monstrosity of a teddy bear. It's annoying. I know so many people that throw them out. I see them on the side of the road, these sad, massive creatures. Um, and lastly, I want to point out that if you like this simple juice, or smart, it's called smart juice. They sell it at ShopRite for seven bucks. Seven bucks, say, a, 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 a quart. And they have all antioxidants and, and all this other stuff in it. Ocean State Job Lot, again, has them always for $3.50 a uh, container, sometimes under $3 when they have them on special. Um, they don't have the full selection that the supermarket does, but they, they do have a handful of them. And, and you, if you like that juice, you save a whole lot of money. Uh, we're going to go over to my tip of the week next. Okay, here's the tip of the week. Think long and hard about shopping apps and what they, uh, what they do to you. Um, the shopping apps out there, there's dozens of them. Um, some of the, there's some more popular than others, but they basically claim that you save a lot of money and you do win sometimes. You win, win a good deal, an exclusive deal, but overall, the, these apps are extremely time consuming and they're very invasive. They, they know your shopping habits, they know where you shop and when, um, and, you, and you get a few nickels thrown at you. Uh, and then at the end of the year, you might, uh, I don't know, maybe save a thousand bucks. But think about the hundreds of hours you waste uh, scanning these deals, looking for the win. Now, this is something called gamification, and it's a psychological phenomenon where people will, will almost 
like, like spend an exorbitant amount of money to get to the next level and they don't even realize what they're doing. The shopping apps are a waste of time in our opinion. I don't care whether you've saved a few dollars or not. In the long run, they're never sustainable. They're just not good. Stick with your shopper's cards for the individual um, uh, supermarkets and, and deal with it and just buy less. We have an article coming out uh, on njboot22.com about this. But we highly recommend that you just delete them from your phone and stop getting consumed by them. Um, you'll thank us later. Have a nice week ahead.